all I'm going to say is, girl, these sales. You hear me? guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here my name is Shakura and I believe that when you feel good you look good so on this channel I show you how to take fashion and use it as a tool to help you look and feel your best I don't have a ton to show you because I kind of want to talk a little bit about the Nordstrom anniversary sale yes I know but we'll get to it because um, I want to kind of have a conversation about that with you there are a few things I want to show you before we get there now I show I showed you these wedges from Anthropology in another video and I still think they're cute but Anthropology came out with a few other interesting pair of shoes. Those of you who like the silver and the metallic trend but don't think you could take it in a full boot or something over the top like I have done and you prefer a flat and like a little ballerina sandal slipper situation, these I thought would be a cute little option for those of you. It's not too much, taking part of the trend just a bit. These earrings are very much on trend with the 90s mom kind of clip-on earrings though I don't think these are clip-on, I might be wrong, but it's really giving that bold earring type of look. These silver metallic boots is something that I would consider wearing to the Beyonce concert. <laughs> While my feet might hurt wearing them, it's giving alien superstar, right? I love these boots. Now these shoes, while they're not something that I would gravitate towards, if you are a person that loves the Elia shoes, but don't want to spend that Elia money, the heels, little heart heels, this is a perfect dupe. Now, the heel is a bit smaller, but it looks so much like it and is giving so much of the same vibe. Okay, so let's make a quick, very quick stop at H&M. So I wanted to show you this dress from H&M because a lot of you liked the Banana Republic dress but didn't want to spend that much money for it. This one from H&M is a very similar option and I believe it's only like $25 or $26. Very similar looking. I also wanted to show you this whole look mainly because I like it. <laughs> I think this is so sensual and just, oh, I love this. This is so me. I would wear this right now in this heat with some sandals or even a pair of sneakers because I'm learning how to integrate sneakers into my outfits. And during the fall with a beautiful blazer and like a handbag, this is so me. And I wanted to show you because maybe it's you too. I love that the skirt comes all the Way down to my ankles I have about three or four slip skirts and only one of them come all the way down and I love that this one is a maxi like a full maxi I love this this bag is just a dupe for the Valentino bag I wanted to put that out there just in case you like that bag and I cannot stress enough how many times and I've told you guys this many times many times these shorts and this shirt as an outfit has saved me when I didn't want to think about outfits especially during this heat in my last video I was talking about jumpsuits and I found this after so I wanted to just put this in from Express I feel like this is a really cool laid-back kind of option especially if you're going on vacation um, and you're just like this kind of vibe dress it up with some gold or silver jewelry or mix it gold and silver or ooh red like a red bag that would really work if this is your kind of style so I found this brand on Instagram and if you know anything about me you know that I love a good pair of sunglasses sometimes I like them to be really fashiony sometimes I like a very classic kind of look that stay with me for years and years to come these glasses are so cool. It's woman owned, it's black women owned. If you're not new here, I am the first to support POC companies, women of color, women. I like to support wherever I can. So anyway, these glasses, look at this video that she has put up. I was in awe because some of these are so cool. So I'm not gonna lie to you, I did order two. <laughs> and it's gonna take a while to get here because it is a small business. Okay, so listen. <laughs> I know that we are currently in July and we have many weeks to fall, but I can't stress enough the impact that this sale season is having on my mind, my body, and my spirit. Can't stress that enough. Listen, okay. If you've been following me for a while, you know that one of my favorite boot brands, Paris, Texas. They 
and my more affordable favorite boot brand is definitely Schutz. Paris, Texas and Schutz are probably, unfortunately, the majority of my boot collection. And I told you before that oftentimes you don't have to spend full price on Paris, Texas. These boots were originally $885. They are currently on sale for $265. Now, do I have a pair of silver boots? Perhaps, but let me tell you why they're different. <laughs> the silver boots that I have from Schutz are a metallic shiny material. And while I love them, they can be a lot. They can be overwhelming just to wear, you know, to dinner on, on a Tuesday. These are still metallic and because they are more of a flat color as opposed to what was so shiny of my Schutz, I feel like I could get away with owning both of them. Am I talking myself into this? Perhaps. But they are $265 as opposed to $800. I would be a fool not to. Like, I have to get them. And then I want to stop by Banana Republic real quick. I don't know if I showed you guys this. I'm on a real silver kick just like everybody else. I know that it might be overwhelming because we're all doing it. Look at this beautiful silver dress from Banana Republic. Are you joking? Again, I don't know where I'm wearing this, but it could be dressed down. Imagine wearing this with some sneakers, maybe white, gray, silver, with like a denim jacket. It can be dressed down. And obviously it can be dressed up with some like cute sandals with a blazer or without a blazer. I really feel like this is so um, appropriate right now for what's in style and can be used a lot of different ways. I wanna show you two things that I got and then we're gonna move on to the Nordstrom sale. I know, it's a whole thing. So about a year ago, year and a half ago, I tried on the Bottega sunglasses like this. Though I like them, I wasn't gonna spend $500 on them because they aren't the best of quality if I'm being completely honest. I have tons of designer sunglasses. It wasn't the price so much as it was the quality. These look so much like those sunglasses. They were $15 from Amazon. And you guys know that I love fashion, I love style, but I love my money in my bank account more than anything. <laughs> so I thought I would show you guys these just in case you wanted those Bottega sunglasses, but you didn't want to spend the $500. I think, again, these are a fairly decent option. They look very, very similar to it. They also come in black and some other colors. And of course, I'll leave it below. Don't you think these are very similar? I actually haven't spoken about fragrance in a long time, but there has not been a fragrance that has done to me what this has done to me. I was first introduced, I think in the fall, to the to the harmonist, harmonist, to the harmonist. <laughs> and I spoke about it in this vlog where um, I was introduced to Hypnotizing Fire. I got the travel spray because I didn't think that I needed the big one right yet, but I'm thinking I might get the big one during the fall. But this, Moon Glory, like nothing I have in my collection. If you are a gourmand lover, you're gonna love this. It's completely different. It is not a blind buy. It, I'm just telling you it is not a blind buy. However, they do have samples on the website and of course I got a few, that's how I knew. I got so many <laughs> samples and this was one of the samples and because I heard somebody talk about it on TikTok and I just had to try it. I am absolutely in love. It smells to me like what a goddess would smell like and who doesn't want to smell like a goddess. I don't talk about beauty and fragrance in my fashion videos because they're fashion videos, but I usually talk about them in my vlogs. So if you love fragrance and makeup and skincare, because I love skincare and body care now, it's crazy, go check out my vlogs because that's where I usually talk about them. But I feel like I had to show you those two things because I forgot to put them in my last vlog. So let's talk about the Nordstrom anniversary sale. If I'm being completely honest, before I started to make videos consistently, I was overwhelmed with, and maybe perhaps a little annoyed with the amount of Nordstrom anniversary sales that videos that used to happen. It wasn't, I didn't feel like it helped me. I felt sold to. That's not my 
Um, that's not my goal here. My goal with this channel is not to sell you all these things, but to help you find your style. What makes you feel beautiful? I want to help you find what makes you look and feel your best, right? So that's why I do a lot of videos that have categories of the cool girl or the playful girl. You've seen those videos, right? Because my goal really is to help you find your style, not just to sell you things. So the Nordstrom anniversary videos personally used to drive me a little bit nuts <laughs> but i am shopping the sale this year or i'm going to try to shop the sale and i want to show you this, some things that i'm interested in some of it is also beauty and i actually want to get your opinion on some of the beauty things if i'm being honest there's not a lot of clothing pieces that i am dying for but i will show you a few that i'm interested in and I want this to be more of a discussion um, and you tell me what you think and we can help each other through this sale. I'm never trying to just sell you things. I'm always trying to help you find your style and pieces that fit into it. I hope that makes sense. A few things that stuck out to me. This dress I think would be good for the office. Um, it's really giving me DVF vibe. I think this is a really nice option. This dress, even though I hate the boots that they styled this with, I like the color. I like that it's very fall. I like that it's affordable. These Topshop pants look very on trend. They look very comfortable and can be dressed up or down, which I love because it's all about um, bang for your buck, right? Cost per wear. And this dress blazer thing is so me. Picture it. This dress with those silver uh, Paris, Texas boots. Do you see where I'm going for here? I like that it has color, but it's also very clean lines and structured. I think this is so, so me and so cute. If you're not new here, you know that I love a nice pair of PJs. I've done my videos many times in my pajamas and I love this option. They come in different colors. They also have a plus size option, which I think is actually cuter. And then as far as basics, they have this little outfit that'd be good for lounging around the house or traveling and a basic white button up. But what I really want to show you is a few accessories and then I want to have a large discussion about some of the beauty products. So these Versace sunglasses are over $100 off. And if you have the face shape that works with these sunglasses, I think this is a great deal for you. This is the New Yorker in me <laughs> that every time I see a pair of Versace sunglasses, the lyric from Jay-Z comes back, I might bring back Versace shades <laughs> every time, every time without fail. And I say it out loud or I sing it in my head every single time. Then this sterling silver herringbone necklace, which I think is a great price. It's usually $80, but it will be on sale for 50. For those of us who don't have silver, who feel like they look better in gold, because I do, but would like to get some more silver, I think this is a great introduction into mixing up your jewelry collection a bit. These 14 karat gold hoops are very interesting to me. I have really been looking, and I think I told you guys in an earlier video, that this year I'm looking more at solid gold jewelry and I have really, I've really gotten deep into it. <laughs> so this is interesting. I haven't checked all the stats on it, but it is 14 karat gold. And if you are the cool girl, these Dior sunglasses and these Dior sunglasses are right up your alley. I can totally see somebody wearing these on vacation. You're definitely cooler than me, but I feel like I see somebody real cool rocking the mess out of these sunglasses. However, if you are a person that prefers an oversized classic pair of sunglasses, these from Gucci are on sale. These from Gucci will also be on sale. These from Celine give you the same oversized classic kind of vibe. And these from Loewe, over $100 off. If you like any of these sunglasses, it is a great time to buy because they are very well priced right now. And if you want a silver bag, a metallic bag, and you don't want to spend that money, too much money, this is a good option. And this Simon Miller pink bag is very much giving me Bottega vibe and is a decent price. 
me show you what's in my bag or saved to my wish list as far as beauty is concerned. I have been umming and awing over this Lancome moisturizer because I'm trying to figure out is it actually better than the moisturizer that I use because this is a lot of money for a moisturizer. You know it's interesting because $240 for a purse or a pair of shoes I wouldn't blink at. Just makes sense. I don't know. That's like a great price for a pair of shoes or a bag. But for a moisturizer I'm like what is it what does it do? Why would I spend that much on a moisturizer? I don't know. But if you have tried it, please let me know. And I have heard great things about Osei. Osei? Osei. How do I pronounce that? And I want to maybe try the lotion or the oil, and this might be a good time to try it. This Estee Lauder serum I use every day, so I'm definitely getting this because this is a really good price. It's good in a big bottle, and then I could get the smaller bottles just for travel. The other moisturizer that I have been umming and awing about is this Augustine Bader moisturizer. I... <sighs> I've heard, uh, again, great things, but like, does it solve everything? Is it worth it? You know that I will spend the money if it is worth it, but I'm trying to figure out like, what does it do? I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try either this one or the Lancome. I would love to know if anyone has experience with this. I'm gonna try it to see if it actually changes my life. We shall see. This Dr. Dennis Girl skincare pads, I use all the time. I'm definitely gonna get this. I've even gotten my husband to use it and his skin is looking amazing. Pat myself on the back. <laughs> These Bobbi Brown makeup base I use every time I wear makeup. So I'm definitely getting this. This is like two for the price of one. They are full price, 100% buying those. And then, you know, these light therapy masks, do they work? <laughs> I would love to know if anybody has used these. I am definitely a marketer's dream, whereas I would try anything, especially for my skin and my hair, I would try it all. But is this a gimmick? I've done a little bit of research on light therapy, and as far as I can tell, people say that it works, and I'm always willing to try. But am I willing to try for $445? Again, if you have tried this or you have any more insight, please let me know. The T3 blow dryer and flat iron and curling iron, I'm getting one of the three. Unless you guys can tell me that they aren't that good, I need to try one of those. Um, even though it won't be flat iron my hair probably to fall because my hair is going to be in and out of braids for the summer. But let me know if you tried any of these. Again, I don't need these brushes and combs right now, but in fall when I wear my, my hair out again, I would love to have this brush for blow drying or styling or whatever. I have been looking at this oil and for whatever reason did not pull the trigger and I think that I want to try it. Has anyone tried this oil? I love a good shower body oil. I just like to walk out the shower moisturize and then I re-moisturize them out. It's a whole body routine that I just, I love. They have fragrances galore on sale. They have this Tom Ford Rose Prick. They have Parfums de Molly, which I adore and it's like the it girl perfume. <laughs> or is it overdone? I don't know. Either way, I love it, so I'm going to wear it. And then I was looking at this Ricky mirror. Not for me to use at home, but I need a mirror to take with me traveling. My mirror that I use when we travel, like to put my makeup on, is huge. <laughs> it is absolutely huge. I have a picture of me the last time we were in Italy putting my makeup on and the mirror takes up the whole, <laughs> it takes up the whole table almost. I love it because I can get close, but I, it's not easy to travel with. So I'm thinking about maybe getting this Ricky mirror, especially because it's on sale. I really hesitated getting it for a while because it's $230, but for $70 off, I feel like I feel better with that, even though that's still a lot of money for a mirror. I feel like it's a good mirror to travel with. This Byredo set, if you have not tried anything from Byredo, this is a good option. I have all of these fragrances in this set and I love every single one of them. It kind of looks like I'm going to be spending more money on my beauty than my fashion for the Nordstrom anniversary sale. And maybe I missed something, I'll let you know in a different video. But I would love any feedback on anything I said today. I love to talk to you in the comments. Anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and I'll see you in my next video.